Fake news fed to artists part four, buying lists. The idea that there is a magic list of collectors that you could buy, that you could just start emailing and they're gonna be, they're gonna love your work and they're gonna love your subject matter. Okay, after you just blindsided them, they didn't opt into anything, which by the way is illegal uh, to be just grabbing that list and emailing them. They have no connection with you or your artwork. And just because they're a collector, like they're buying other people's art, you think that they're going to actually just be interested in buying your art. The worst strategy, this is definitely taking the cake as the worst idea that anyone's ever come up with. This doesn't work. Don't ever buy a list. Don't ever get it in your head that there's a magic list out there or that you can be added to a list and somebody will market your work to this list. Okay. Just get it out of your head. Has never happened. Has, I've been in this industry for 25 years. I've worked with over 100,000 artists. Never ever once has a list ever worked except to extract money from the artist.